Well, good evening. I uh, I am Excite. Um, went out on our travels today. This is just going to be a quite a short video, by the way, just an update on some stuff. But went out on our travels today to a local town, and uh, we were looking around all like the charity shops, stuff like that. Basically, I'm looking for for retro gaming stuff, um, any broken old electronics to you know have a play with, have a repair, get my uh, get my bearings a little bit. And uh, just just something to you know do videos on and enjoy myself in in my spare time, um, and found nothing. Like since CEX came along, uh, charity shops don't tend to really carry electronics, which sucks. Um, so we decided to go into CEX, and um, not going to go into all the details, but we had an ask around. You know they have some faulty equipment sometimes. They pointed us in a direction, and and we spoke to someone else, and they pointed us a direction, and we ended up. Finding a treasure trove. Excuse me, that's the chinchillas in the background. Um, yeah, so I bought a box of stuff from a uh, electronics repair store, actually. Um, and they were really good, man. It was all stuff that they couldn't repair, I think, or maybe wasn't economical to repair. Uh, I got a really good deal on all of it, because I think they were just looking to get shot. And there's actually been some really good stuff in this box, so I thought I'd go over some of it, just show what I got today. It's today's haul and uh yeah this is all stuff we're going to be repairing over the next couple of days so uh oh, this is the box it all came in uh this is just the i wouldn't say trash but this is the stuff i'm sort of less interested in right now um but we'll go through that at the end i'm not gonna uh I'm not gonna make you wait to the end to see the good stuff um so i think the first thing to look at is these and i'm quite excited about these actually these are Apple iPad keyboards. Um, I have four of them in varying states of disrepair. Um, one of them apparently pairs. They use uh, AA batteries on these. So one of them pairs. One of them, I think it said it doesn't hold a charge. Doesn't hold power, but it's battery powered. I might have to look into uh, to how they work, but it seems that a lot of them have keys that don't function properly, um, which could be interesting. I have no idea how you get into these, but I'm sure it's pretty simple to find out. Um, so I think these will be the first ones I'll be doing a video on, because I might be able to make one good one out of these. And I actually have an iPad um, that I use for Clash of Clans and, and stuff like that. So uh, if I can get two of them working, that'd be even better, because my stepson has an iPad and an iPhone. Um, so we could have some nice, uh, some nice little keyboards. So um, yeah, luckily these have stickers on them that say what the problem is, so I don't have to guess. Um, so that's the first lot. Let's put them over here. Uh, and then what do I show you next? Next we've got this. Uh, this is a Samsung Galaxy 2, I believe. Um, it seems in semi decent condition there's a few marks scratches stuff like that no experience with these at all i'm going to plug a charger into it doubt you would have heard that but it does vibrate um and also these uh these lights do light up the every now and again i can get them to light up i can't seem to get it to do anything else um so whether it's the battery's absolutely dead it's just trying to boot and it can't which i doubt or the screen could be broke um so yeah, I think we'll be stripping that one open. I'm gonna leave it on charge overnight, see what happens, just in case it is like a completely dead battery. Um, I shall leave it on charge overnight and see what happens. Uh, the next thing is this, which I was very surprised at. This is the iPad I have. I have a white one. Um, and it was in the bo bottom of the box, just like this. As you see, there's quite a bit of damage around the screen. Obviously, someone's tried to get into it at some point. Um, other than that, it, you know, it's a bit dented and dinged and scratched, but you know, I don't care. But the best thing about this one is I decided to charge it and it works. I don't know if it's gonna hold the charge. Um, I haven't actually unplugged it. I'm gonna let it charge to 100%, see what happens. Um, so this could be, maybe need a battery changing. Uh, definitely needs a new uh, either screen or the glass. Maybe the screen is too expensive. To replace this broken glass so they, they don't want to do it so i mean i'd use it like this i don't care it's a little bit broke still works right uh and then what else do we have to so have some iphones uh i got this pile i have this as a just to 
yeah, that's that's piles of iPhones there. Uh, this rose gold iPhone back. There's some randomness in here like this, which I don't know what iPhone that's from. These seem to be um, iPhone 5s and iPhone 4s. And then this doesn't fit any of these, but this looks like a brand new screen. Like it's got a full thing on it. So I don't know what this is. If anyone knows what this is, it's a bit smaller than a... That's an iPhone 4. And then that's an iPhone 5. So it's quite a lot smaller than, than the rest of them. So I don't know what that is. Um, so these are in varying states of disrepair. So these are the 4s. There's a few, uh, there's a lot without batteries, obviously. Some do have batteries. Uh, there's quite a few screens. Screen on that one. And this one, uh, I haven't tried to charge this one yet because the iPads, I'm charging that iPad, only have one iPad charger. So I might try and put a charge in that. This one, which is a five, let's have a look at those. Let's pop them there. These are just backs, which I'm guessing are for fours. Yeah, fours, I think. Uh, so yeah, the fives, I tried to put a charge into this one. It's definitely been opened at some point. Uh, doesn't seem to do anything, which is fine. This one I thought might charge, you never know, but I don't know if they're, they're picking that up. It's rattling, <laughs> which is a bit, uh, but they're the only two um, complete and with screens. The rest are all just motherboards, basically. Uh, I do have two batteries and a random motherboard uh, here. I don't know what they're for. I literally like I've never owned an iPad or uh, an iPhone in my life. The iPad I have, I only have because someone gave it to me. Um, so yeah, I have no experience. I had to get my stepson in here to actually identify what iPhones they were because I have no idea. Um, so that's them. Let's pop these back. Then the other randomness. So we have uh, these, I believe are, that I have a Samsung Galaxy S6 and these are S4. Fours, I believe, um, in varying states of disrepair. I think two of them are missing batteries. I think that one has a battery in it. Um, so, I mean, yeah, that's that. And then we have these, which are, uh, one's missing a battery, but they're Samsung Galaxy uh, S2s, I think. And we have this, which is a, Samson A5, whatever that is, never heard of it in my life. Just looking at it in this light, the screen is absolutely shredded. Like, uh, I don't know if the camera will pick that up, but yeah, look, there. It it's apparently doesn't power on and I haven't tried it yet, but underneath that screen looks trashed. I wonder if the phone's good though. I don't know, but that could be a bit of fun. And the best thing about all of this is uh, I'm used to doing like uh, electronics, like consoles, Game Boys, stuff like that. I've never really dealt with phones and tablets, and I always wanted to, but the, the price to get into it is quite high. Um, so even if I can't fix any of this, like it's going to be great just for experience pulling it apart and tinkering. Um, so we might have some tinker videos. We're definitely going to have some videos where I try and get this stuff working. And if I can't get it working, who cares, man? I didn't pay much for it at all, really. Um, so that's the, like the main cool stuff and then we have this big old box here uh, some of this is pretty sweet oh and this like before I go into that there's also this uh, it's a Samson something and it does that like I have no idea what this is uh, it has like a plug I've never seen in my life so I mean if if anyone knows what this is, please put it in the comments because I have no idea. Um, so yeah, there's that. And then there's this box in here. There is some more iPhone stuff, but there's a um, Arcos crappy tablet thing. There's a Blackberry. I haven't seen one of these in years. Um, there's some notes for stuff. There is some iPhone, more iPhone. I think these are iPhone ones. I've just kind of left these in here because I mean, they don't look like they're useful. This is an iPad, though, iPod. And I actually had one of these. I wish the front was there to it. Looks quite bent up though. Uh, so there's the iPod. There's a Sony Xperia thing. Uh, a Sydney. I have no idea what this is. 
must be some Chinese thing. Uh, another iPhone 1 back. These I'm really interested in getting these working. These are flip, flip phone Nokias. I love flip phone Nokias, bro. Um, and then another flip phone Nokia. I'm down with that. Definitely down with that. This is a Vodafone something. No idea. Absolutely no idea. It kind of looks like an iPhone knockoff. Who knows? Um, some old school push button Samsung. This one is a Sage M. Oh yeah, buddy. <laughs> Hopefully I can get that working. I'll literally use that instead of mine. Oh, there's a second eye. There's two iPods. Did not know that. Two iPods. None of them have screens. There's a uh, Cybershop thing with a camera boy. No battery or anything on that one. I think a lot of these are just, you know, I'll probably strip them apart and just see what, what's in there. It's like a Samsung knockoff Blackberry. I think I had one of these. Uh, some random back for something. There is this one. I, I actually had one of these as well when I was younger. Samsung uh, slide phone. Loving it. No battery on that one though. Um, another Sony Ericsson Cybershot-y thing. I don't know, it's a Walkman one. I don't know if that'd be any good. Uh, Sony Ericsson Walkman phone thing. Oh, and that's the Slidey Boy as well. Do like the Slidey Boys. Proper old school Nokia. Too bad there's no 3310s. That would just have, uh, that would have absolutely made my day. And then there's another Cybershop 5 megapixel T-Mobile thing. These were sold mainly for the cameras, right? If I remember rightly. Uh, there's this old school boy. Um, and it's a horrendous colour. Like, <laughs> that's horrible, man. Uh, some pink Sony Ericsson thing. There is some utter trash in the bottom here. This Nokia N series, which I remember being quite good. That's the N8. I actually remember these being decent phones. Uh, the N series. I don't know if that one is. Uh, another iPhone. And this is the proper old school uh iPhone ones, I think, and then another slidey Nokia boy, and finally a T-Mobile Samsung thing. So yeah, that is my haul for today, and probably what we'll be doing videos on over the next couple of weeks. Um, I also do have my SNES, which I got to do. I have a keyboard, a proper uh, Corsair keyboard. I need to try and fix, and hopefully get my new gun. They have sent out the. Uh, they're actually just going to replace this. Uh, so they've sent this out. So I'm going to have to obviously open up the unit and replace the gun and hope that the gun is the issue. Um, I'll probably do a video on that of replacing the gun in case anyone else has to do that with theirs. Um, and we'll see how that goes. Uh, so yeah, I'm going to try and slow the videos down a bit because I keep getting really excited. I get excited. I love doing this. So um I keep getting excited and I record the videos and I edit them because that's what I love doing. I love editing videos and I love recording. So, um, and I love repairing things. So I want to repair stuff. So I film it. Then I want to edit it. So I edit it and I'm like, Oh, I really want to upload it because it's cool and I really like it. And then I upload it and you end up like the last week or so has been a video every day. Um, so I may try and do it like once or twice a week. So I'll, I'll still film them and edit them and just keep them, um, and, and release them more slowly so that, you know, I don't know. I probably won't. I'm I'm quite Im impulsive. <laughs> so yeah, there might be a ton of videos. Anyway, stop me rambling on. That's uh, that's my haul for today. Um, so hopefully you guys are excited as I am. Um, we'll get to watch it. If you are excited to watch them, make sure you uh, subscribe to the channel. Um, put anything you want in the comments. If you can identify that screen or if you know what that Samsung thing is, please hit me up and let me know. Um, but yeah, otherwise, I shall see you in the next video. Have a good one, boys. Bye-bye.